Get in. We're live. Hold that for a sec. Why? It's gonna grab my beer. But also, I just managed to get you to hold the camera. <laughs> I'm not holding it the whole time. Stop being a sport sport. There's no one. No one wants to join in. No one wants to come to France with us? No. It's quite peaceful. So, how do you feel about the footy result? Nil, nil. Fine. Got a man sent off. It's not that bad, actually. Take it. What had a win? Hey, we've got someone in. Hey. Two. Yes. How's everyone doing? Well, I say everyone. How how's all two of you how's doing? How's all two of you doing? We're going to wait for a few more people to hopefully oh, join. Oh, seven. There we go. Oi, hey. oi, boys. Now then, Wade. We're going to wait for um, a fair few to join and then we'll kind of... Chris flip, Jolly, hello, mate. Flip the camera around. You guys back in France? Yes, we are. Yes. Mike's quest for fish. How's it going, lads? Yeah, we're good. Andy Wilson. On the evening. beers, as usual. Billy Lewis. Not bad. How's the fishing? Uh, Could not... be a bit quicker. It's a bit slow, yeah. but it's not been that bad. We've had fish, though, not going to lie. Yeah. How many beers down, lads? How many... We've had a few today, haven't we? I think this is my fifth. Yeah, I think I'm on about five or six. Kitch, Kitch, who's come with us. So there's obviously a group of us here. Oh, he it's 47 live now, Jesus. <laughs> Kitch came to France with us last year. Um, big lad. And he can neck him. I think he's on like his 13th or 14th beer so far. Um, I don't know how he's still standing because little old me, I would be on my arse. Foxy, you noddy. You what, mate? <laughs> you are. Who um, Who just said that? Nathan Henry, I think i just seen you're going to Drayton. Good luck, mate. Oh, class. How long are we staying? We're staying for... We've got another six days, another haven't six we? six days, so yeah, we're here our... for a week. Is this our first full day or was yesterday our first full day? Nah, this is the first full day. Yeah. Because yesterday we turned oh, up we about couldn't fish until two, two three, PM, and then, could we? And then we just took ages getting getting the bivvy set up. You want some? Yeah, I want some. <laughs> Who is that? I don't know. <laughs> uh, how was the drive down? The drive oh. down was Do you know horrific, what, right? not going like, to lie. From, from obviously, Borough to um, London Dover. or Dover, it wasn't that bad. What was it, four and a half hours, five hours, something like that? It weren't that bad. Oh, no, it was actually maybe five and a half hours. Um, but then once, we had to wait ages for, for the ferry to get on yeah. the ferry. Yeah, yeah. That was a nice little hour and a half journey. weren't too bad. Obviously, we were knackered. And then... The other side the other just side. felt like it was ages. I had a squeeze, though. I didn't have to drive on the other side, so I could pretty much sleep. So yeah, I drove from Middlesbrough to London. So Wait, I'm just switching hands because... Uh... You're aching. Yeah, a little bit. Um, has OMR caught a grassy yet? He hasn't <laughs> yet, actually. Hasn't. There's only a few grasses in it. Here's Max Kitchen. Oh, Shut yeah, up, yeah. you little dickhead. Tight lines. Cheers, George. Was that George? Adidas George. Don't know who that is. Don't know. Um, yeah, no, oh, Mars not had anything yet. Someone asked before, has there been any PBs? There has been a PB. There has, yeah. There has been a PB. Uh, but we're not gonna give we're not gonna give too much yeah, away. We don't really want to give too much away. I was just saying to Foxy before we we started this, I said, look, people are gonna ask like if we caught fish, how what you know, weights and stuff, and you know, we'd rather try and, you know, be idiots or prats and build a little bit of suspense for the for the actual video. Yeah, so, yeah. But yeah, we've had we've had we've had fish. The beer squad just asked, has Jamie come with us? Yep, J Dog's here. Jay's here. Jay's here. So we so we've got J Dog. We've got Max who came to France last year. Omr and then obviously us too. So. You say Max. His name is Max, but I call him Kitch. Kitch. We call him Kitch. Or dirty bit. <laughs> dirty bit. <laughs> what lake you on? We're on. Um, it's a lake called Villafond. So if you Google it, it will be on angling lines, and that is the lake that we're on. Do you want to see it? We'll give it a little flip Spin round. Around. Oh, there we go. So, Max, oof, dirty bit. <laughs> yeah. What, so this eight, is the eight lake. Acre lake. Eight acres. It's very, it's very much down on water at the minute, yeah, on water very, levels. Yeah, very down. Now then, Adam. Are we doing another free vlogs? We don't know. It all depends how, how this session goes. Um, I'll just show you our swim. So three rods there, 
three rods there, bivvies together. Give, gives a wave, Kitch. He's right over there. I don't think I can zoom in, but he's over the other side. He's waving. You spending nights on the bank? Yes, we are. We're we doing... are on this one. Unlike the last trip to France where we were uh, fannies and stayed in the, the uh, chalet that was there, we bunked. Bunked up, didn't we? Craig Smith, you're sharing rods? Yes, we are. And Mike's just asked the same question. We are sharing rods. Um, you know, this is that old thing where we don't want to come away and one of us... Imagine, be a bit... imagine coming all the way to France, filming with someone, the person next to you has it off and you don't catch a thing. Exactly. That's, that's heartbreaking, Proper isn't it? So you've got to share the love. Proper tart spoon and bivvies. What's that? Proper tart spoon and bivvies. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we I've I've tarted my bivvy up. Mate, I'm not I literally lie. said to him like probably about two hours ago. I said, oh, we should have had our bivvies facing each other so we could see each other." Yeah, that's a bit much. <laughs> Old Man River is with us. Are we using OG baits? Um, no, we're not. We're using Parker baits. Yeah, Parker um, baits. Um, I don't got, know if you mean like because he calls he calls some of his baits OG. OG doesn't yeah, he? so uh, fruit and nut and um, uh, the fish. OG fish. But we've also got some particle made by the lake owner. Yeah. I'll just show you the particle. What tactics? Someone just asked about tactics. Oh, well, do you know, obviously we, we love the Mega Method feeder. Um, 56 gram, short hook link, and... It's produced. It's produced it's already. Produced. It is the one that we've had a PB on. So yeah. literally and works everywhere. The others have uh, had some other fish on. There's no ones, but... Yeah. Yeah. Um, what do you want to do? Do you want to walk? Do you want to walk around with it? Uh, yeah, should we go and see? It? Billy Omar? Lewis just sent you a message on IG, lads. All right, we'll have Check a look at that in a bit, mate. Check that out. We'll have a look. Do you want to go around and and show? Yeah, we'll go and see OMR. Script. Adam, yes, I did watch the Leeds match. It was all right. <laughs> I'm gonna stop here because obviously the rods. Yeah, because you're next on the rods anyway. Next at the minute, so I'm gonna stop here for the rods just in case. Get Wayne some proper 12 for game for the pants. <laughs> some what? Proper 12. Oh, nah, I don't bring it. I'm not bringing whiskey. I know, yet. to be fair, I'm yeah, just keeping it light and simple on the Desperado. Um, but I do plan on getting shit faced tonight. Are you going to so. come back? Eh? You're going to nip around and come back? Yeah, yeah, yeah. go and do a quick one with OMR. Right, uh, Wayne 100% has a beer. <laughs> well, well, well. To be fair, we have had a few fish out, so I might let you know that we've each had a turn. Uh, Eva, oh, 10 beers down. Yeah, exactly. I need to get to the 10 beers down to start feeling a little bit wavy. But yeah, so listen, we're on peg six. That's peg six. There's eight pegs on this lake. And obviously this is peg five, which was too small for... Me, me and Foxy to get on, but none of the other lads wanted to jump on it. And to be fair, we didn't even have to like draw pegs or anything like that. We were quite adults about it. And uh, yeah, just kind of amicably, amicably chose. 10 beers what? <laughs> Max is on about 15 beers now. So we're coming around to, what is this, peg four. And this peg's got a lovely bit of space, like for, you know, couple of bivvies as you can see um but there's not really a lot of space for two rod pods and six rods here although if i was on my own i'd probably choose this peg because there has been fish boshing over here but anyway we move we keep it moving come into omr omr is on peg three Oh, that was a big bosch through there. Did you see that bosch, Mark? Have you? Have you? Don't. That was a big bosch. You got the old mega method on there. Two on the old leads, lead clip. So this is OMR set up, regimented as always. <laughs> We're live, Mark. Yeah. YouTube. We've yeah, got Mac, yeah. we've got sixty live at the minute. Good. Yeah. Great stuff. As you can see, 
the weapons are down there. Mark can go up to the island if he wants. I've got one in line with the, um, the aerator. That's where that boss was, wasn't it? Yeah, that was, yeah. And then I've got one halfway to the island in the line with the swim eight, the cabin. Oh, right. Oh, yeah, there's a, the yeah. swim eight's got a cabin on it. I don't know if you can see it over there. But it's literally, like, awful for bivvying up. No one's chose it. The water level's really low over there as well. So it's a bit hard to net a fish and jump down kind of thing. So that's been ignored, that peg kind of. But uh, OMR's all right. You know, apparently the water level, as you can see here, obviously Mark's got his rods there, but you wouldn't have been able to put your rods there some time ago. I think I think the um, the water level kind of comes up to, up, to there, yeah. up to about here. And all that's normally in water. So that just goes to show how, how down it is. Three feet, aren't you? Yeah. yeah, yeah, not far off that. So as you can see, even o OMR is on the bank for the whole week. The man that said he wouldn't do an overnighter is doing a whole week in France, fair play. Stuck your brolly in the table. Well played. Got your bait down there, your boat. Got the right setup going on. Just need some fish. <laughs> the last thing left, the last thing left. Right, I'm gonna keep it moving whilst we still got some light. Yeah. Sorry, say bye. See you boys. Thank you, bye-bye. Right, so that was peg three. As we move down here, we've got a double peg. There's peg one and two. Look, Kit, you're actually watching and I'm coming to see you. <laughs> That's this, the legend that is Old Man River. He is, isn't he? Happy days in France. Good luck to you all, fair play. Cheers. This is Kitch, so double peg as I said, but Kitch has chosen to kind of lean on peg two. Peg one's just that side. Um, but as you can see, he's got two bivvies. He is a proper tart. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's, he's living comfortably. No, I'm sensible. <laughs> <laughs> so in here, no light, but like that one, this is like his, like his front room. Front room slash kitchen, to be fair. Look, he's got a little light. And then, over here, it's his bedroom. Who brings two rooms in, to France? Fair play to the lad, doing it right. There's his rods, swim. You're, you're, you seem to be the closest to the island, I'd say. Yeah. But this is like, this end of the lake is where the shallower water is and uh, Kitch chose to be down here. Mega uh, shallow. It's even shallower when you get into peg one. It's even yeah. shallower there than what it is here. Looking you're forward the, to these France videos. The Good luck, boys. And I'm Cheers, Shane. On the drop here, aren't you, really? Peg two. To yeah. peg one. So, but nothing to come out just yet. Unfortunately not. We'll get there. Carry on my year, eh? We'll get there. <laughs> we'll get there. We'll get there. Uh, right. We'll have something out. Fingers crossed, like. We'll definitely have, uh, definitely have some out, I think. Cool. Right, I'm gonna keep it moving. We've no still got worries. some light. Are you going that way? Or are you going I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do a whole lap. You go right round. I'm gonna do a whole lap. I'm giving a lot of the place away for the videos, but hopefully it just keep you wanting to come and watch the vids. You what, mate? I know. I know. It's because I've been putting the rods out and that. <laughs> All right. So we move down. Here we come to like. Listen, the facilities are not as good as they were in the last trip to France. I'm not going to lie. Food's good. Food's all right. But it's like a caravan, which is literally a shell. Like, it hasn't got any electricity. Like, Old Man River was going to be staying in the caravan, but it's that rough that even though MR don't want to stay in there. Bless him. And then, like, the shed next to it is basically where you have like your toilet and uh, like your, uh, your shower. That's run off solar power, as you can see there. Take you in there. Sorry if you can hear me breathing. Getting me 
get me at it. Oh, so as you can see, it's not like, it's not the best in the world, but you're here to catch fish, aren't you? You're not here to pose for showers and that. Get in here. Basic, basic as hell. So, but we had a good deal on this. We had a good squeeze. So as long as the fish come out, I'm not complaining at all. Oh, little bridge here. There's like a stream that kind of runs around the lake. Well, it used to be a stream. There's no water in it anymore. It dries right up. Oh, there's a little bit of water. We move, we keep it moving. You're not using your bivvy again, Wayne. No, I'm using my bivvy, mate. My bivvy, I prefer to stay in my bivvy, to be fair, because that uh, caravan is not the one, I'm telling you. I remember this is an eight acre lake, uh, eight pegs on it. So, see, I'm coming around the back of it now, so we're approaching peg eight. Yeah, four foot to nothing in the shallows. I mean, to be fair, even in peg six over there, there's some four foot areas. Dharma van. I don't know what that is. So that's peg, that's peg eight. And like I say, it's kind of like the winter peg. We haven't, like, you have to pay extra to, uh, you had any carp yet? We have had carp, mate. So you have to pay extra to have this, uh, which we haven't done. So again, like, you know, this, the water level is kind of normally, as you can see on the pole going into the ground, up to where the white bit is. And uh, yeah, that's locked up. You can see in there. Again, not the best, looks a bit rough. Yep, like Drayton all over again. Tell me about it. I've already been in the water in my um, sliders again. I've actually gone out, me and Foxy went out to the supermarket today, um, bought some wellies. Best 15 euro I've ever spent. They were Dunlop though, so to be fair, Probably could have got those in Sports Direct for about five or. And here we come to peg seven. We'll see Jamie. Jay's got the boat by his peg. No real reason for that. It's just because it was here. He's got a table. Barra bait water. And there it is, peg seven. Probably the tidiest peg on the lake. But the famous legendary pink sliders. And there he is. Hello. How you doing, mate? Living the dream, mate, you? Yeah, I'm alright. How was food? Yeah, it was good, mate. You enjoy it? Yeah, I did enjoy it. It was a decent roast. I I thought the the meat was a bit dry. Was it turkey or pork? I couldn't even tell. You just ate it, didn't you? Yeah. It was probably one of those flipping birds walking around the corner there. I'll put one of the, I'll put my dinner picture up on uh, Instagram. Yeah? Yeah, it looked pretty good. I've uh, not had a roast dinner anywhere better, really. Fair. Good scenic, uh, scenic views, isn't it? Fair enough, fair enough. But, um, How's the fishing? I forgot I was fishing, to be fair. <laughs> to be fair. <laughs> I've, had, I've had two two-pounders. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. That's about it. That is about it. You've pulled out some really small fish there, Jay. What's going on? It's kind of what I do, I think, when I go to France. <laughs> just uh, go to France to catch big fish. I go to France just to sit in my bivy and catch tiddlers. Yep, fair play to you. Again, as you can see, look, the water level's really low. He's got his rods down there, typically. He'd probably be up here. But nice view from this side of the lake anyway. Well, Jay, love you and leave you, mate. Yes, bud, good luck. You too. See you a bit. That's the boat that you got a little bit of use of. Well, you got access to, I should say. And 
here we move on round back to peg six there's quite a bit of um, a bit of a gap between peg six and seven so the fact that we've got no one fishing in three or four either i mean sorry four or five either we've got quite a lot of water to play with Yeah, I was sat with uh, Kitch earlier on having a beer and there was a big fat rat that ran across his uh, pod. Has Kitch been... <laughs> no, not yet. No boating beers across the lake has happened just yet. The biggest in here, I believe, is roughly around 80 pound. So fingers crossed for that. As you can tell, that hasn't come out yet. Gave that one away. And there's your boy. I did a lap. How you doing? steps in. Yeah, I needed to after that big dinner. Yeah. All right, yeah, so let's... Oh, I feel knackered after that. Still got 65 on live. Yeah. 80 pound G's, I know, yeah. That's what we're yeah. after. We want... That's what we want. We've been saying all week, he's been saying we're going to pull the 80 out. Not us, I just said I feel one of us out of the five of us. It's what are those really pants, good. these ones? These are my uh, fishing pants. <laughs> <laughs> is it because you've got your lead top underneath? Possibly, it's my lead top. Oh, stuff, is that yeah. a bosch there? See that? that was you a... can't zoom in, can you? No, I don't think so, but you can still see it. That was a big bosch. A bit further out than what we're fishing, like. That is. We've actually been told like by the um, the owner of the bailiff that we don't need to fish far out at all. Apparently, the margins are really good as well, so just been you know listening to his advice, really. Is that? Bryce said, glad you didn't wear him at Drayton. Cheers, Dazzy. Right, so, should we... Want to stay on for a bit? Are you well, holding it? Is there any more, is there any more questions? Cause, I don't know. I mean, if not, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll bid oh. you a farewell. But just chatting to you in the tip. Oh, now then, Johnny. Yes, you're right, mate. I did, I saw you at the tip. Oh, what, you just getting yeah, some, I was, some I was rubbish? putting some stuff away and he'd come up to me, yeah. How's it going, mate? You all right? That ref today for the Leeds game was awful. See? He thought I was complaining and being being stupid, but the ref was genuinely crap. Any Arsenal fans, though, by the way? Any Arsenal fans? Because we've got a lot to shout about right now. I think there is a few gooners that follow the channel. We've got a lot to talk about Who right knows? now. But we do get more people saying, commenting, saying all, of, all, all Leeds, aren't we, and stuff. Mm. What's the bottom like? The bottom, it's a bit it, of a mix of silt yeah. and gravel. Mm. Um, it's like it starts off gravelly, then it gets but silty. silty for for a bit, but there are some gravel spots out there apparently as well. Yeah. Um, he's kind of told us roughly where they are. We haven't really bothered to find them as yet, have we? Oh really? yeah, we, we are probably going to get the deeper out and stuff and do a little bit of uh, looking around at some point. Mm. But um, there's craze in here as well, so we've got that to contend with. Yeah. Come on, rhinoceros, nosser pigs. Yeah, hopefully. Nosser pigosaurus. Hopefully, let's get a nosser pig. As uh, Parker boys would say, Parker brothers, North London is red. There you go. There's a gooner. Get in. He's even got. He's even got the gun and his, the. Royal That's Arter the one thing. on fire at the minute, aren't we? What's that? I don't know. I think he might be having a stroke. Michael, you alright, Michael? Are you okay? <laughs> Good luck, lads. Have a great week. Thank you very much, Simon. Thank you very much. Yeah, fingers crossed it's a good one. <clears throat> mm, mm. And I think, yeah, someone was saying, oh, is it going to be free videos before? It all depends. All depends. I say. Oh. Ooh, smash those PBs. Well, we can give away because we've said it already that one PB has been smashed already. Yeah. So. Have you found stop. the spots easy <coughs> enough? Well, we kind of haven't really found spots as such just yet. Um, sorry, it went a bit funny there. We haven't found spots as such as yet. We've... Um, We've been told. I haven't like, got the deep route yet. We've, so, we've, but we've had you know, loads of advice from the uh, lake owner. He's also the bailiff. He fishes here a lot. So we've yeah, just gone off that to start we've off. Gone with. Off that. Probably get the deep route tomorrow and have a real look about them. See if we can find some spots. Beer squad just asked when's the actual video for this going to be out. Um, probably end of October, early November, I would mm. say, because we've agreed that we want to make it a good one. We want to put a lot of effort. So we're going to spend this. a bit of time on the edit. 
Um, we're not mm. going to rush it. What rigs we got on? We've got the trusty method feeder and the, the old hair rig on most of them. Um, Just like the, the tactics that we feel works best for us. It's all about confidence at the end of the day. So, yeah. Yeah. And those mega method feeders, they work. Yeah, they do. So I, I didn't see who it was, but someone said, are we going to do a live all week? Um, probably not all week, but we might go live again yeah, towards the end might, of the week. We might go live again, yeah. If, uh, if people want to want to see that and we can kind of update you on how the session's going and stuff. Yeah, we're going to get some B-roll of some um, ro some Robins, Bry. Don't you worry about that. <laughs> Loves his nature, does Bry. Not with your TV. Cheers, Mike. Um, it was a common... That's all you're getting. <laughs> What's that? Yeah, do some more lives. Did you sneak boilies of it? We, well, yeah, we did. Um, but to be honest, I wouldn't say we snuck them over. We literally just flung them in uh, Max's had van and... Had them in the back of the van. Didn't and... have no checks. Mm. So whether, whether if we would have got stopped, they would have got taken off us, I'm not too sure, but we... We took 20, we 25 kilogram of uh, Parker Parker boilies. Definitely do another live if you can. Yep. Yeah, okay. We'll we'll make sure we do one towards the end of the week. Then maybe Thursday, Friday, or something like that. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So I think for now. Starting to get dark now. Starting isn't to it? get dark. We're gonna get settled into our bivvies and. But well, we're sort we're uh, an hour ahead. Here. Yeah. So. So it's like what is it? Twenty to eight. Something like that. A quarter to eight. Yeah. And yeah, we're about to lose light, so um yeah, we shall bid you a farewell. What was that? I didn't see that pop up that question now. Did you not? No mate. No. Right, yeah, we'll leave it at that, but thanks thanks to everyone for tuning in. Hopefully yeah. you've enjoyed the live and enjoyed having a little tour of the lake and finding out what, what the score is. Um so, tight lines. Tight lines. Tight lines. Um but yeah, we'll like we say we will we'll try and go live later in the week. And we'll catch you then. Who's that? Top one? Laters, lads. Course fishing. Ah. Tight lines. Cheers. Cheers, everyone.